Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Misty Moss of Moss Photography and today I wanted to talk about something really dear to my heart, which is why you as a boudoir photographer, because I'm assuming you're a boudoir photographer if you clicked on this video, need to get in front of the camera for your own boudoir photos. So stick with me through this video as I go over three reasons why this is not only good for you, but paramount and essential for your boudoir business as well. Let's go. All right, so as photographers, we spend a lot of time helping other people feel really good in their skin, learning to love themselves and celebrate themselves, but very rarely do we actually do the same for ourselves. I hear of a lot of photographers who have never done boudoir, but who do boudoir professionally <laughs> or have never done self portraits in front of the camera to work through their own body image issues and i think that these things are so important for helping us connect deeper to our clients so my number one reason why you as a boudoir photographer need to do your own boudoir photo shoot is to heal the projections that you could possibly be making onto your clients and that a lot of newer photographers myself included probably did at one point in their journey because you haven't healed yourself inside yet so because we're humans we tend to project our own biases onto the people that we are photographing so one of the biggest reasons why you need to do this is so that you can work through those inner biases reflect on them heal that bullshit that has been taught to you and that is just festering inside um, work through it so that you can create a safer, more neutral, uh, body inclusive space for your clients. Once we start doing our own inner work, it makes the spaces that we hold and create for others that much more beautiful and inclusive and safe and exploratory and just better. So just do it, <laughs> do the work. All right, reason number two why you need to do your own boudoir photo shoot is once you go through the whole process, start to finish on your own terms and in your own eyes, you can better empathize with your clients when they're going through their own boudoir photo shoot that you're facilitating for them. This way you'll know when they're in their photo shoot, if they're in a certain pose and they look a little bit uncomfortable, you can know, oh, I know what this feels like because I've done it before. So you can help guide them through it um, in a really organic and empathetic way. You'll also be able to connect deeper and better with them when they're looking at their photos, which can be one of the hardest parts of the process that our clients don't really like expect to be a difficult part of the process, but often it can bring up a lot of triggering stuff around our bodies and how we feel about them. Um, so once you go through this process yourself and you work through those emotions and those feelings around your body, you can help create a more encouraging, welcoming, empathetic space for your clients while they are experiencing that same thing. Being able to empathize with your client from start to finish, from firsthand experience and not just like professional experience, like it's one thing to know how something works behind the scenes but it's another thing to actually fully experience it organically um, once you're able to empathize with all the range of emotions and feelings that can arise in this experience you're able to create just so much more of a transformative experience for them and they're gonna be so much more impacted and have such a better positive experience because you were able to give them that depth of experience all right Whew moved to the bed by accident when I did that. Number three, and possibly my favorite reason for why you need to get the heck in front of the camera is that you deserve this experience as much as your clients do. You deserve to feel just as beautiful, just as powerful as you allow your clients to feel. And especially because you spend so much time and so much energy helping other people feel that way and giving that gift to others, you deserve to give that gift back to yourself. You can do this in a couple ways. You can get in front of the camera by doing your own self-portraits, which is a very different healing process and practice than having a professional do it for you, um, but powerful in its own way, in a different, unique way. 
still super transformative and enables you to empathize deeper with your clients throughout their boudoir experience but also allows you to kind of create images that speak to you and maybe if you're not ready <laughs> to let go of that trust um, and give it over to another artist it kind of allows you to create within your own parameters and with your own artistic vision um, but still getting that beautiful celebration of self that you deserve the other way obviously to get in front of the camera is to hire another boudoir professional to do it for you and i recommend really just investing in another photographer just like you ask your clients to invest in you um, and just giving over the experience to them and allowing them to guide you throughout it and you can trust them um, because this is obviously going to help you empathize deeper with your clients because you have also given the trust over to somebody. You've also taken that plunge and allowed somebody else to document you in that own way through their own eyes. Doing this, you are going to be able to fully, fully celebrate yourself and love yourself because you don't have to do the work. You're paying somebody else to do it for you. Um, and you can fully just feel amazing and celebrate yourself, which I feel like I've said a million times already, but whatever. It's just like, that's that's the theme of the video um, while also strengthening that bond with your clients and deepening that aspect of your business okay that is my three reasons why you absolutely need to get in front of the camera as a boudoir photographer if you liked the content of this video and you really resonate with healing your body image issues self-love and self-celebration through a photographic practice i really encourage you to join my facebook group it is called art and soul collective um, where we just hype each other up um, and celebrate each other and try to grow our self-love through photography you can find the link for that down below in my description and don't forget to like subscribe hit that bell and i will see you guys in my next video Bye-bye.